Hey, what's up guys, Steve here. And today we're gonna take a look at the 50 highest selling 1995 through 1999 basketball cards from the PWCC weekly auction that ended on January 7th. And we'll kick today's list off with one of our weekly regulars at number 50 with this 1996 Topps Kobe Bryant rookie, card number 138. This rookie was in a PSA 9 and it sold for $186. Up next at number 49 is this 1997 Upper Deck Michael Jordan, card number 18. This was a PSA 10 and it sold for $204. Coming in at number 48 is this 1997 Skybox Z Force Tim Duncan Rookie, card number 6. This rookie was in a PSA 10 and it sold for $216. Up next at number 47 is this 1997 Upper Deck Nestle Slam Dunk Contestants Die Cut Kobe Bryant, card number CC1. This second year Kobe was in a BGS Gem Mint 9.5 and it sold for $222. Coming in at number 46 is this 1996 Stadium Club Members Only 55 Michael Jordan, card number 41. This was a PSA 10 and it sold for $228. Up next at number 45 is this 1995 Upper Deck MJ Collection Michael Jordan, card number JC15. This Jordan was in a PSA 10 and it sold for $240. Make that three straight appearances at number 44 with this 1995 Upper Deck MJ Collection Michael Jordan, card number JC6. This was a PSA 10, and it sold for $252. Coming in at number 43 is this 1997 Topps Kobe Bryant, card number 171. This second year Kobe was in a PSA 10, and it sold for $264. We welcome a newcomer to today's list at number 42 with this 1997 Finest Embossed Die Cut Jerry Stackhouse Refractor, card number 157. Serial numbered out of 74, this refractor was in a BGS 7 and it sold for $264. Coming in at number 41 is this 1996 Topps Mystery Finest Super Team Finals Michael Jordan Refractor, card number M14. This refractor was in a PSA 8 and it also sold for $264. Make that back-to-back -back appearances to kick off the top 40 with this 1997 Skybox Premium Michael Jordan, card number 29. This Jordan was in a PSA 10, and it sold for $288. Up next at number 39 is this 1996 Flare Showcase Class of 96 Kobe Bryant Rookie, card number 4. This Kobe Rookie was in a PSA 9, and it sold for $324. Coming in at number 38 is this 1997 Bowman's Best Mirror Image Michael Jordan Refractor, card number MI1. This refractor was in a PSA 10, 
and it sold for $348. Up next at number 37 is this 1996 Finest Michael Jordan Refractor, card number 50. This refractor was in a BGS 8.5 and it sold for $360. Up next at number 36 is this 1997 Bowman's Best Michael Jordan Techniques Refractor, card number T2. This Jordan Refractor was in a BGS 9.5 and it sold for $384. We welcome another newcomer to today's list at number 35 with this 1998 Fleer Tradition Playmakers Theater Grant Hill card number 7. This was a BGS Gem Mint 9.5 and it sold for just short of $400. Coming in at number 34 is this 1995 Topps World Class Michael Jordan, card number WC1. This Jordan was in a PSA 8 and it sold for $420. Up next at number 33 is this 1995 Topps Gallery Michael Jordan card number 10. This was a PSA 10 and it sold for $444. Coming in at number 32 is this 1995 Skybox Premium Michael Jordan card number 15. This Jordan was in a PSA 10 and it sold for $468. The Warren makes his first appearance on today's list at number 31 with this 1997 Finest Dennis Rodman Refractor card number 275. Serial number out of 1090, this refractor was in a BGS Gold Label 10 and it sold for just over $500. Make that back-to-back -back newcomers to kick off the top 30 with this 1999 Bowman's Best Allen Iverson Atomic Refractor, card number 75. Serial numbered out of 100, this refractor was in a PSA 8 and it sold for $540. We're back to the mid-1990s at number 29 with this 1995 Hoops Top 10 Michael Jordan, card number AR7. This was a PSA 10, and it also sold for $540. Up next at number 28, is this 1997 Upper Deck Diamond Vision Dunk Michael Jordan, card number D1. This Jordan was in a PSA 9, and it sold for $810. Coming in at number 27 is this 1995 SP Championship Shots Die Cut Michael Jordan, card number S16. This was a PSA 10, and it also sold for $810. Make that three straight appearances for the GOAT at number 26 with this 1996 Fleer Michael Jordan card number 282. This was a PSA 10 and it sold for $870. Up next at number 25 is this 1999 Topps Gallery of Heroes die cut Kobe Bryant Card number GH3. This Kobe was in a BGS Gold Label 10 and it sold for $1,020. 
make that back-to-back -back appearances at number 24 with this 1998 Skybox EX Century Dunk and Go Nuts Kobe Bryant, card number 6DG. This Kobe insert was in a PSA 8 and it sold for $1,020. Up next at number 23 is this 1997 Stadium Club die cut Michael Jordan, card number T9B. This was a BGS Gem Mint 9.5 and it sold for $1,110. Coming in at number 22 is this 1996 Skybox EX2000 Kobe Bryant Rookie card number 30. This was a PSA 9 and it also sold for $1,110. KG makes his first appearance on today's list at number 21 with this 1997 Upper Deck Diamond Dimensions die cut Kevin Garnett card number DD21. Serial numbered out of 100, this KG was in a PSA 8, and it sold for $1,140. Make that back-to-back -back appearances to kick off the top 20 with this 1997 Hoops High Voltage Kevin Garnett, card number HV10. Serial numbered out of 500, this was in a PSA 8, and it sold for $1,200. Up next at number 19 is this 1995 Hoops Number Crunchers Michael Jordan, card number one. This Jordan was in a PSA 10 and it sold for $1,260. We welcome another newcomer to the list at number 18 with this 1998 Metal Universe Jalen Rose PMG, card number 116. Serial numbered out of only 50, this PMG was in a BGS 8.5 and it sold for Up next at number 16 is this 1996 Skybox EX2000 Credentials Shaquille O'Neal, card number 32. Serial numbered out of 499, the Shaq was in a BGS 9, and it also sold for $1,440. Coming in at number 15, is this 1999 Stadium Club Chrome First Day Issue Kobe Bryant Refractor, card number 87. Serial numbered out of only 25, this refractor was ungraded but authenticated by NBA, and it sold for $1,560. Up next at number 14, is this 1996 Ultra Michael Jordan Platinum Medallion, card number P16. This Jordan was in a PSA 8, and it sold for $1,980. KG makes another appearance on today's list at number 13, with this 1998 Skybox EX Century Essential Credentials Future Kevin Garnett, Card number 13. Serial numbered out of 78, this parallel was in a PSA 9, and it sold for $2,520. Up next at number 12 is this 1995 Metal Maximum Metal Die Cut Michael Jordan, card number 4. This Jordan was in a PSA 10, and it sold for $3,240.
We're sticking to the mid-1990s at number 11 with this 1995 Hoops Skyview Michael Jordan, card number SV1. This was a PSA 10, and it also sold for $3,240. And Tim Duncan makes another appearance on today's list to kick off the top 10 with his 1998 Fleer Tradition Playmakers Theater, card number four. This was a BGS 9 and it sold for $3,480. Up next at number nine, is this 1997 Stadium Club Michael Jordan, card number T1B. This die cut Jordan was in a PSA 10 and it sold for $3,600. Coming in at number eight, is this 1997 Skybox Z-Force Rave Review Michael Jordan, card number six. This was a BGS 9, and it sold for $3,720. Up next at number 7 is this 1995 Stadium Club Michael Jordan Warp Speed, card number WS1. This Jordan was in a PSA 10, and it sold for $4,320. Make that four straight top 10 appearances at number six with this 1997 Ultra Star Power Plus die cut Michael Jordan, card number one. This die cut was in a PSA 10 and it sold for And kicking off the top five of today's list is this 1998 Fleer Tradition Playmakers Theater Shaquille O'Neal, card number 12. This Shaq was in a BGS 9, and it sold for $5,040. Up next at number four is this 1996 Finest Kobe Bryant Rookie Refractor Patch, card number 269. This was a BGS Gem Mint 9.5, and it sold for $8,700. Coming in at number three, is this 1998 Metal Universe Michael Jordan Lynchpins, card number eight. This Jordan was in a PSA 9, and it sold for $100 short of 10 grand. Up next at number two, is this 1996 Skybox EX2000 Credentials Michael Jordan, card number nine. Serial numbered out of 499, this was in a BGS 9, and it sold for $11,100. And make that three straight appearances to top off today's list at number one with this 1996 Skybox EX2000 A Cut Above Michael Jordan, card number five. This die cut insert was in a BGS 9.5 and it sold for $12,000 even. Thanks for joining me today guys and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.